Colonial Teachers by Toby Stewart Coming to America In the early 1600s, people from England came to America. They formed colonies, but were still ruled by England. The Pilgrims were some of the earliest colonists to arrive in America. They landed in what is now the state of Massachusetts in 1620. English colonists traveled to America on large ships. The trip took more than three months. Colonial Schools The colonists set up schools for their children. Some schools were in teachers' homes. Women usually ran these schools. They did chores while students did their lessons. Some towns had one-room schoolhouses. Men usually ran these schools. Teachers who taught in their homes often held classes in their kitchens. Making Time for School More boys than girls went to school. Most families needed their children to work on farms or in shops. That didn't leave much time for school. Most parents believed that it was important to learn how to read, so they tried to send their children to school as often as they could. Many children went to school and worked on the family farm every day but Sunday. Teaching the Children Most teachers taught reading. Teachers taught students the alphabet and simple words. They practiced by reading prayers. Most colonists thought everyone should be able to read the Bible. Some students also learned math. A colonial student's most important job was to learn how to read. Pleasing the Teacher Colonial teachers expected students to study hard and behave. Children had to bring wood for the teacher's fireplace to pay for their lessons. A child who forgot to bring wood had to sit far from the fireplace. A child who could not answer the teacher's questions had to sit alone in a corner. Colonial students had to study their lessons carefully so they wouldn't be punished. A Long Day Colonial children started their day at dawn. First they did chores at home, then they went to school. The school day ended at about five in the afternoon. Teachers would have students say a prayer, then send them home. The children had more chores to do before bedtime. Colonial children were very busy.